Solve exponential equations. Now in these examples, we have taken some negative numbers and let's see how to work with these negative numbers. Minus 27 equals to minus 3 to the power of x. To solve an equation, what are we trying to do? We are trying to write 27, rather minus 27, in an exponential form. That is, base of minus 3 with some power, right? That is the whole idea. So minus 27 could be written as minus 3 to the power of 3, right? If you multiply minus 3 3 times, what do you get? Minus when multiplied 3 times, you get minus. And 3 times 3 is 9, 9 times 3 is 27. You do get minus 27, right? So therefore, we can write minus 27 as minus 3 to the power of 3. And now, we have minus 3 to the power of 3 equals to minus 3 to the power of x. Since the base is same, their exponent should be same. And therefore, we can write x is equal to 3. So that is the idea and that is how we are going to solve it. So at this stage, I will request you to pause the video, solve these two questions and then look into the solution. So the questions are minus 2 to the power of x equals to minus 32 and minus 5 to the power of x equals to 25. Here is my solution. On the left side, we have minus 2 to the power of x. On the right side, we have minus 32. How can I write minus 32 as minus 2 to the power of something? That is a big question. And that something is 5. So I can write this as minus 2 to the power of 5. Minus 2 times minus 2 times minus 2 times minus 2 times minus 2 is minus 32, right? Now we have an equation with same base, which is minus 2. And therefore, exponent should be exactly same. And so the solution is x equals to 5. So that is the strategy to solve such exponential equations. Next one, minus 5 is the base and we need to find the exponent x. For that, I need to write 25 as minus 5 to the power of something. That something we know is 2, right? When you square minus 5, you get 25. And therefore, the answer should be x equals to 2. So that is the solution for minus 5 to the power of x equals to 25. Go through this exercise and then move on with next set of questions. Thank you.